Hi there and welcome back to the Floss Marketing School. In this uh, video, I'm going to talk about uh, custom uh, columns in uh, Metabase and uh, it's very useful as well if you are using information systems such as Matomo Analytics where you would like to make uh, calculated metrics. So for the sake of this video, I will introduce uh, the following concept which uh, does not exist in, uh, in Matomo Analytics. So let's imagine, for example, that you would like to get uh, the market shares of page views as you can see here and you would like to extract them. Uh, even we, you would like to extract those 5.6%. Uh, in fact, uh, you cannot uh, you cannot do it, right? It's appearing within uh, the UI, but if you export this given file, you're not going to get it, right? So uh, you can export it like this, but uh, you will see as a final result, you will get those uh, market shares uh, showing up. Okay, you see, it's not showing up. Uh, so we're going to see with uh, Metabase how you can do it. So for this, I use uh, SQLite uh, integration in order to import uh, the CSV. And I create after one my table with the label page views and unique page views. And as you can see, uh, those are the same. Okay, those are the same that uh, we can see here. Oops, doo -doo -doo, that we can see uh, over here. So I would like to make up here the 5.6%. By chance, Matomo is explaining me how it's getting it. So it's taking the number of page view and divide them uh, by the number of uh, the total page view divided by the number of page views in order to get it. And uh, this total, the uh, 349. Or five, I'm getting it because this is the total amount of those pages, the one that you can see over here. Okay, so I can either take this one or I can either um, use the table that I have over here. Okay, uh, so now let's create a column which is called, let's say, like market shares of page views, and I'm going to add it uh, over here and I'm going to make my mathematics. Uh, based on it. So I just click here on the show editor and then I create here the custom column which is going to be equal to, I can take, so the number of, I can take the number of page view that I can divide by uh, the total amount of uh, page views. Uh, so in my case, uh, we said it was this given, this given number. Okay. Um, I'm pretty sure that I can take a variable as well. I just didn't take uh, just use it so uh, market shares market shares for page views for page views and I'm clicking on down okay and let's uh, visualize and here as you can see I'm getting my market shares for page view which is at um, okay I can even make it maybe a little bit more beautiful and uh, change it by just uh, multiplying it by by a hundred like this okay let's do it this way update and let's visualize so here I'm gonna take my five uh, six two and five three four which seems like correct my correct okay five point three three point three and three point three um, so I get, I, uh, I guess I got it, um, seems like it's working, so um, um, that's uh, everything that I wanted to show you today, so uh, in order to create those calculated metrics, you just need to click over here in show editor and then just create your um, custom colon, give it an explicit name and then make the mathematics as, um, as you would have done it. Hope you enjoyed this video, thanks for watching.